Hello, hello, I'm Sam I am somewhere. And today, that somewhere is, we are at the Burlington Regal for another out of the theater movie review. It's Thursday night, that means it's movie night, and tonight's movie is The Boys in the Boat. It is a sports movie. It was directed by George Clooney. And it is based on a true story. It means that really happens. Let's jump right into our review. Boom. I'm in. This movie has no in-credit scenes. My first reaction, it was very interesting overall. Adam up, you're up. What was your first reaction? Well, it's the first movie of 2024, and uh, it's the best movie that we've seen so far. <laughs> Donnie, what was your first reaction? Uh, it was a um, good first reaction. I, re I really enjoyed it all the way through. Marie, what was your first reaction? I really liked it. Yes! She's back! Let's move on to the positive things. My positive things was I liked the storyline, and I liked the coach that was in the movie, and the characters in the movie did a great job. Adam, what were your positive things? I came out of that movie kind of happy. It's the <laughs> second sports movie, so we saw the, the Iron Claw. We saw that last week, which is a good movie, but you come out sad. This movie, I came out happy. It was, uh, it was uplifting. Donnie, what were your positive things? Uh, just the whole feel-good movie all the way through, you know. It was, uh, it was a happy movie, you know. Happy endings, happy story. Aww. Marie, what were your positive things? I really thought it was a great love story and happy story and just happy ending. It just was a good feel-good movie. It's a little bit of a, a, a romance. <laughs> <laughs> Let's move on to the negative things. My negative things was, I don't like the Nazis. Adam, what were your negative things? I have to agree with you there, Samantha. I didn't like the, the Nazis either, and I was glad to see uh, the University of Washington representing the U.S. at the Olympics in 1936. Donnie, what were your negative things? I, I have to, you know, definitely Nazis. Nazis are bad. Marie, what were your negative things? I have to go with Nazis too, but I have another one. It was freezing cold in there, and Donnie thinks it was hot at some, sometimes, but I thought it was freezing cold the entire time. That was my negative for sure. I, I do have one other negative. This is kind of like a, a paint by numbers sports movie. It covers all the cliches. They're all in there, you, but you know what type of movie you're, you're going to see if you're going to see a sports movie, and it, it is what you would expect it to be. Like a Lifetime movie. Lifetime Christmas movie? Yeah. yeah. Almost, almost Hallmark, <laughs> yeah. Let's move on to the rating. I will rate it 7 out of 10. Adam Up, what would you rate it? I will rate it an 8 out of 10. Don Solo, what would you rate it? Uh, probably go 6 out of 10. It's not a bad movie, but there's no thrills or anything in it. But it, you know, it's a good movie. I'll definitely watch it again. Marie, what would you rate it? I would rate it an eight. Would you pay to go see it or, nah, just wait for streaming? I would uh, pay to go see it. I would pay to go see it too because I really like sports movies and I've seen other sports movies too. Donnie, what would you think? I think you could wait till streaming, but uh, I would... <sighs> <laughs> yeah, wait till streaming. Marie, what do you think? I paid real money, not membership like some <laughs> people. Um, so I would pay to go see it. Well, well, well. We did it all. We took care of the chicken business, we watched a movie, and we talked about it. Next week's movie is The Beekeeper. <laughs> so if you enjoy this video please hit the like button and you could subscribe anytime because it's free for you okay guys thanks for watching and we will see you real soon